What's up, Orange Nation? Every great workout has to start with a great dynamic warm up. We have three exercises, one minute each. We're going to go through those two rounds for a total of six minutes. You ready, Felix? Let's do this. All right, our first exercise is going to be the alternating bird dog. Get down into a tabletop position. Extend out one leg, the opposite arm extends out. Bring it back to your set position. Do the same thing on the other side. Reduce the range of motion for your option. The second exercise will be the plank walkout. So stand up, try to keep your legs nice and straight, walk out to a plank, walk right back, stretching through the hamstrings and stand up. The option, bend the knees as you go into the walkout. Our third exercise will be the around the world lunge. You're gonna stay on one side for all three movements. Lunge forward, feet together, lunge to the side, feet together, lunge in reverse, and then we do the same exact thing on the other side. The option will be reducing the range of motion. Again, it's one minute each, two rounds, six minutes of work. Let's get warm, y'all. Make up your mind what you're searching for. Is it money? Is it something like freedom? Nothing against myself, but I can really see myself. Come around, come around, come around. Now I'm holding it down. I thought I was quiet, but then you brought that loud. It's instant that I mentioned. Did you know that? In a minute, I felt different. No take backs, take backs.
pacing back and forth back and back and forth got no one in my corner and i gotta work it out feeling forces trying to dim my light teeth clenched knuckles all white all white all white life got me punched drunk on the ropes suffering blow by blow fight toe to toe chasing bets but All right, guys, the next block is gonna be five minutes and your goal is to complete three rounds. You ready, Genesis? Ready. First exercise, we got the knee tugs. So hands by your hips, go ahead and try to bring those knees as close as you can onto your chest and back down. Option here is to do one leg at a time. Next exercise, we got the forearm plank punch. You're gonna be on a low plank position on your forearms. Try to keep that body nice and straight. Arms up, punch like you mean it. Alternate it with the next. Arm, go ahead and bring yourself to your knees as an option. Last but not least, guys, we got the weighted pike. Go ahead and grab a weight, straight line on that body, create a V, trying to put that uh, dumbbell right across all the way, touching those toes, and back down. Option, bend those knees and give me a crunch instead. All right, guys, ready to rock and roll? Let's kill it, let's do it. I've begun to grow, and now I know you're the one for me. And I've been known to give in to easily be poor. But I know I feel something I've never felt
right, team, so we have an eight-minute block here. Your goal is to repeat the next four exercises until time is called. So first up, ready, Leah? So we have hip hinge low rows, leaning forward, hinging at the hips, keeping those elbows close to the body as you drive them up to the ceiling and then slowly extending your arms all the way. Your option here is to let lower the weight and you're doing 12 reps here. Then you have ground to press up next. So you're gonna drop it down to a squat, power up and push those dumbbells up towards the ceiling. Your option here is limiting that range of motion. Again, 12 repetitions for that one. Then you have overhead tri tricep extension, just one weight here. You're extending your arms all the way up into that um, over your head and then bending at the elbows till you watch that um dumbbell disappear behind your head. Again, 12 reps here. Then we're going to go down onto the mat and you have your swimmers going onto your tummy, extending your opposite arm and opposite leg all the way up, squeeze those glutes up top and then coming right back down. All right, team, let's get to work.
What's up, Orange Nation? For this block, we got five minutes, three rounds. You're gonna do 30 seconds of each exercise, 15 seconds of rest after each round. You ready, Coach Julia? I am ready. Let's go. First one, we're gonna start with our power sit up to rotation. So Julia's gonna keep her hands on her ears. She's gonna drive that opposite knee and opposite elbow together, tightening her core. Next one, we're gonna go for our reverse crunch. So hands are gonna be on either sides. We're gonna drive those knees in towards our chest and then we're just gonna place and tap those feet on the ground. Last one here, our kneeling plank, low to high. So we're gonna start on that forearm plank position, knees are on the ground, she's just gonna drive to her palms and then come back down. Again, you're making sure that your core is engaged, those hips are tucked. Let's get to work.
guys, this block is made just for you to get your heart rate up. Seven minutes and 15 seconds of work. 30 seconds of work, 15 seconds of rest. This is an add-on block where we will add an exercise on each round. Genesis, you ready? Yeah. All right, girl, let's get to it. You got that pop squat first. Feet are hip width apart, going low in that squat, exploding up, and then going right back to the center. Option, take the power out, rotate it out, come back in, go into that low squat. Next, we're going right into that ISO squat to alternating punch. Nice and low, quick punches. Then we're moving next into that star jump, going nice and low, exploding up. Yes, just like that. Star jumps. Last thing, we got a double crunch. So we're gonna head onto our mat now, extending that arm and those legs nice and long, elbows and knees, extending back out, engaging your core. Option here is just to tap your toes on the ground instead. Seven and a half minutes of work, let's get to it.
If you didn't get the memo, Orange Theory Fitness is back. We're back up to almost 1,000 open studios and we're stronger and safer than ever. If you haven't had the chance to check on your local studio, let's do it together. All you have to do is log into the Orange Theory mobile app or visit orangetheory.com. Search for your home studio location and give them a shout. They've been waiting to hear from you and we are now ready to get into our flexibility block. Ready, Coach Nikki? Yeah. All right, so we got four minutes of work. We're gonna start off with an overhead tricep stretch. Taking that elbow behind the head, you're pulling gently on that elbow, stretching out that tricep, then moving into that standing chest stretch. So arms start off up towards the ceiling and then you're pulling down, keeping those shoulders nice and pressed down. Next, moving to a standing toe reach. So keeping a slight bend in those knees, you're gonna make sure that head goes all the way down just so you're not keeping any tension in it. Then we're gonna move on to our mat. We have a figure four stretch. So you're gonna cross that knee over that other knee and then you're gonna bring in those thighs towards your chest. And our last flexibility exercise is gonna be that happy baby. So you're bringing those feet up towards the ceiling, you're grabbing onto your toes and you're gonna let those knees fall into your armpits. You're gonna hold it there for 20 seconds, feel that stretch. Then for another 20 seconds, you're gonna rock side to side. We got four minutes. Let's go ahead and cool that body down, team. I seem to spend 